Cheers from Ed over at Antique Toys. How's everybody doing? I thought I'd get a interesting response from the crowd by reviewing fire trucks, a popular kids toy, but fire trucks in three different scales, uh, two if not three different genres. Um, we're gonna start with Ertl Toys and this is actually not such a shabby toy. I know it doesn't get much respect, but it's American made. It is cast iron. Well, I should say die cast, excuse me. And it is extremely shiny. And um, this was, I believe, late 80s when Ertl still made toys like this, fire truck toys in the United States. So. I guess my comment would be that the quality control is really quite excellent. And it's the Sea Gray Fire Truck 1926 style, and it was made in uh, Dyersville, Iowa. The next fire truck is going to be more of a 30 style, a fire pumper by Hubley. And it ends up being the Diamond T style grill which is a pretty distinctive emblem, distinctive bolts, cross bumpers, and the horizontal grill. I bring it up because, you know, the more I own this, the more I almost want to keep it in my collection rather than sell it. Um, and I say that because I've gained a lot of respect for the swooping lines. It's a very deco. Um, I believe the era of it would have been about 34, 35, possibly 36. And then next, we've got the Aaron's Fox, which blows a lot of people away in terms of its size. It ends up being 11 inches in theory. But I believe the 11 inches goes about to here, and then by the time you get the ladders on, and there's a second ladder, I don't have pictures, but by the time you get the ladder on, it's closer to a foot. And comes with the rope, the brass nozzle, and the items that a lot of people really rave about are the details behind this casting with the gauges, details like the fins, details like these structures to hold the running board and then obviously it's gigantic normally this breaks right here um, in this example it's intact so here we can see current 30s and I think this is more of a later 30s but anyways beautiful hubbly um, I believe this one's Hubbley, and this is Ertl. So, cheers for Matt over at Antique Toys. Please enjoy, and please subscribe. Take care.